they've been, my guys have been waiting on this for the simple fact we let one go at our place. We we're up seven with a minute and 20 to go, and we, we just, you know, peed down our leg a little bit. Our guys want another crack at it and make sure that if that happens again, that, we're, that, 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 that the outcome won't be the same. So they've, they've allowed themselves to, to get a third crack at Belmont, which is a great basketball team, especially in our league, and that's all we can ask for right now. We've been talking about it. Uh, we're going to get Belmont again. You know, we finally got them. And this time, I, I, I'm pretty sure it won't be the same mistakes as last game. You know, we're gonna come out with a lot of, a lot of passion, a lot of enthusiasm, and really get out there for 40 minutes. Sam Marippa's offensive end has his pocket picked by Arrington, one on one with Thomas. Bounce ahead, Story, right block to the hole, score, score, yes. And he'll be at the line as he fouls. And I think I got three of the best guards in, in all the basketball collectively, as far as driving the basketball. And these guys are resilient and relentless at getting to the rim and making the right play. It's win to go home. You know what I mean? It doesn't take a lot of motivating anymore. You know, these guys know that we're good enough and we're just as good or better than any team in our league if we play as hard as we know we can play. And when, when we lost to them the last time and we were up seven with a minute, I mean, we dominated them for, for 38 and a half minutes and we didn't shoot the ball great. We just defended, you know, that's our identity. And then we spread you out. Belmont don't like playing zone. They're not, they're not the quickest team defensively, and we were getting to the basket. And they don't, they don't have a guy in the back that, that's a big-time shot blocker. So that, that we use that to our advantage. We just didn't seal the deal with the last minute and 21 seconds left to go in the game. And we, we actually did all the work all week long, and then when it was time to go get a paycheck, we turned, we, we, we turned on and went home without, without any money. So... Um, we got to make sure if, if that's the case this time, uh, my guys will be willing and ready to not let that happen again. Be right corner, Moore feeds it back out, knocked away by Kelly. Back to the trailing Warren, to Kelly. Baseline right to left, count it. I told Drew Kelly and I told everybody else, no matter who we bring in this year, we're only going to go as far as you go. We need you to be in a very important piece, spiritually, emotionally, physically, because you are that piece, you're the glue guy. You know, you're a coach's son, you keep everybody together when you're in it, but he's been the guy that keeps everybody together with great leadership and people listen to him. So that's the reason why we've been successful. It's been because of these guys, but behind the scenes, Drew Kelly's been that guy and I needed him. And, and he, he, he's more than worth his weight and go.